the next blow delivered in the fight between Hamilton County and the city of Cincinnati over control of the Metropolitan Sewer District. Good afternoon, I'm Adam Clements. Hamilton County Commissioners have unveiled what they say is a new plan to end the back and forth between the county and the city in regards to the Metropolitan Sewer District. Local 12's Elaine Kong is following this story. She joins us live now with what we are learning today. Good afternoon, Elaine. Good afternoon, Adam. Hamilton County announced this morning they're going to be filing a motion with the 7th District of Ohio to move 20 employees from the city side to the county side. Now, the proposal is supposed to create better working relations between the county and the city of Cincinnati in regards to the Metropolitan Sewer District MSD. Now, Commissioner Todd Portoon says communication with the city started to become a big issue in 2013. Now, under the MSD operating agreement between the county and the city, the county sets policy and the city is supposed to operate MSD. But even with this disagreement, even with this agreement, there has been a serious disconnect when it comes to projects to prevent homes from flooding. But the district has a history of alleged financial mismanagement and communication problems. If this if this motion is approved, Commissioner Fortoon says it could end up saving a billion dollars. We need everybody to continue to do what is in the best interest of ratepayers. And what's in the best interest of ratepayers is to end this fight, end the dispute, recognize that the sewer district is a county sewer district where the city, by law, by contract, uh, is the agent of the county in, in running the, uh, the sewer districts. Again, the county just announced this today, so they haven't had a chance to submit it to the city to let them know about it, especially since there is litigation that is involved right now with the county and the city. The reason why they couldn't let the city know about it before they were to announce it. Now, we did leave a message for the mayor of Cincinnati. Hopefully he gets back to us and we'll have more on that at five o'clock right here on Local 12. Elaine Kong, Local 12 News. Adam, send it back to you. All right, Elaine, thank you for that.